morning, everybody. Some of you know me already, so Sylvain Shampoo. So if you don't know me, yes, I got a funny name, French accent, French Canadian. But there's a connection with Cadillac and uh, French Canadian, because Cadillac, bef before being a famous car company, Cadillac was a lord, French lord, mm -hmm. that came from Montreal more than 300 years ago, and uh, he came to uh, the states and he founded a city, and that city is named Detroit. So that's the connection. So I'm very happy to be with you this morning. First reason. We have here a very uh, world-class uh, racetrack, Cora. We, you will be driving a world-class uh, cars, the ATSV, and also my team is one game away from a uh, next round and playoffs, so I'm very happy. <laughs> <laughs> go, Abs, go. <laughs> so if you, the American don't know what I mean, they know. <laughs> So uh, yes, so this uh, this car is just amazing. Three weeks ago, I was I had the chance of driving the car on this track, and uh, before I was reading quick, fun, and nimble. And now these words are not only words; they are stamp emotion in my brain. It's really a nice car. It's um, to test that and to really uh, challenge the car and yourself. We have uh, the this uh, F1 uh, race track here, 20 corners. Very long straight uh, where you will be able to uh, test the uh, power of the engine. Heavy braking in corner one, corner 12 and uh, 11 where you really could test the uh, Brembo brakes. <coughs> Some high speed S's, uh, high speed double egg packs, very technical section. So anything you need to really challenge a car and a driver. And to make it even more spicy and summery, as, uh, there's a lot of uh, camber change on that track. Uh, sometimes it's very subtle, but if you do a driver mistake, typically you will end up in an area where they will be off camber and that will uh, punish yourself even twice. So uh, obviously the designer of that track know how to, to do it. It's not his first uh, track. And um, this track is very smooth. And one of, think, uh, I think of the uh, main strength on that car is MRC, the third generation. I strongly recommend you to uh, go on the rumble strip and uh, you will be am amazed by the difference. So we'll drive the car in different mode and test going on the rumble strip and it's really amazing how the car stays stable even on the harder mode with the, the track mode. It's, uh, it's pretty impressive. But stay away from the big orange one. This, these one could destroy the suspension. Uh, like in the S's, they remove it because uh, typically in uh, from a Formula 1 race, there will be some huge speed bump there. But uh, since there was a Moto GP race a few days ago here, they remove it and didn't reinstall it. So maybe you could be a little straighter in the S's than normally you could. So doing so, you could establish a real good lap time and be proud about it. So we will, in all the cars, we'll have radios. So uh, we'll, be, uh, we'll go first with the, the, fir the first half of you that will go with us on the track. We'll do an orientation lap. We set up a, a slalom uh, uh, course and also a place where you will be able to test the launch control and do an ABS uh, to a stop uh, brake test. So really enjoy the power of these uh, brakes. By the way, you will be able to test uh, the automatic, the manual, the, the manual transmission of the active rev match. So you could enjoy a no blip lifestyle with that car. And uh, also there's a, there's a no lift shift, but uh, remember it's uh, really hard to unlearn and learn uh, new things. So when you will try the no lift shift, make sure you're still clutching, okay? You still need to use your left foot, okay? We keep the right foot to the, to the floor, but you need to use your left foot. So uh, uh, be safe when you will need to do any passing. There will be about five to six cars maximum on the track, so it's a long track, but still watch your mirror, and if there's any passing involved, make sure maybe there's a point by by the car in front of you to make sure there's good uh, uh, understanding of uh, what needs to be done here. Uh, we set up some cones on the track, so if you don't know the track, we set up some uh, turn-in, apex, and track-out cone to help you. Uh, but uh, like on this track, it's like I remember watching the, the race, uh, Alonso and Hamilton were using different lines in some sections. So it's a very tricky and very challenging track, so you'll have a, a lot of fun. So, ready to drive? Here we go. So we <laughs> 